Hi. So sometimes my banjo summons voices. My fingers fix on a pattern and I start to hear someone singing. It comes in fragments, usually nonsense syllables, maybe a word, a little bit of a phrase. And I try to listen and then I start to craft it into a song. And it's always so fun to figure out who's singing. Sometimes I get halfway through the song before I know who's singing. And it's the surprise and mystery, together with the working and the honing, that really drive me. And this morning, listening to the talks, I found myself wondering what surprises and mystery our collective creativity might call forth, and how we might work together to connect the creative community in the Hudson Valley and the, what ideas we might hone together into action. It's very exciting to me. <laughs> so um, this first song was born out of a picking pattern in the key of F in the open tuning of G. And it's called Iphigenia in Aulis. She was the daughter of Agamemnon, king of the Greeks. And she's singing the night before her life is sacrificed to the gods so that the Greeks can sail to Troy and fight the Trojan War. It's not a traditional banjo tune topic. <laughs> but I like, you know, I like to take them the way they come.
ago, this little slippery little banjo riff just kept relentlessly repeating itself. And then a voice started coming. forever to figure out who was singing. And I got almost finished with the song, and then it dawned on me, it was not a person, it was a beverage. <laughs> a beverage I had been enjoying that summer. So this is called gin. One drink at a time 